Hi guys and welcome back to Flow Dance London Studios. My name is Elena and together with Marius we are presenting you the rumba tutorial number one. The figures that we are looking at are open hip twist to fan, alemana to circular hip twist to fan, rope spin with spiral and sliding doors. We are going to break down each figure individually, look at technique and dance to music. We are very excited to get started, so let's begin! Let's break down the technique for open hip twist to fan, but before we begin, I'd like to mention that we made an in-depth tutorial for rumba leg work and you can find the link for that in the description of this video below. Here we go guys, open hip twist to fan to count. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. And now the little steps only to count. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Stand nice and tall with the body weight on the left ball of the foot. Prepare to move forward by rotating the left hip through and bringing your right leg forward. Rotating right hip to check forward walk and replace. Close your feet together, change weight and back replace on the right foot. Now stronger rotation on the left side and opening up to fan position and extending your right side. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. I will turn around so that you can follow with me as I teach the technique for these steps. So, standing on the right leg, straight leg, hip towards the heel. Left leg is free and we begin. And four, straighten the leg. One, roll the body weight onto the heel, bend the knee and brush the leg back for the second backward walk. Two, transfer weight, three, forward and brushing the leg through for the forward walk and swivel. Straight axis here on your standing leg. We're going to continue into forward walk. So, rotation of the hip, flick the leg forward, forward walk, another forward walk, brushing the leg through, hip rotation, step forward, straight axis here, upper body turns, foot turns, and now we're ready to step into the backward walk. Bend the knee, bring the leg through, four, one. And now, the same to music. Here we go to count and two, three, four, one, 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 two. Three, four, one. Leader steps to count. Four, 
one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and four, one. Standing in fan position, nice and tall, over the ball of the right foot. Rotate right hip to bring left leg through, to check and replace. Two, three, close your feet together, change weight to the left, back, side, and forward walk. Next is check on the left foot, forward, replace, and bring your left foot back into letting cross. Press onto the ball, side, slight rotation, cross again, side, continue the same, cross and side, close your feet together, change weight, back replace, two, three, and into the fan position, extend your right side nice and tall, and two, three, four, one, 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 two, three, four, one. Let's break down follower steps. Alemana, circular hip twist to fan. So we begin with a fan position, hip firmly on the left foot, arm to the side, straight leg at the front. Bend the knee to bring your legs together, brush them together and change weight. Two, continue into forward walk, three, hip rotation, brush the leg, another forward walk, four, one. We're going to prepare to rotate, it's quite a lot of turn here, so make sure your axis is straight, upper body turns, hips and feet turn. Step forward and across, four underarm turn, upper body turns, lower body turns, make sure your foot is turning all the amount of turn. Continue into forward walk. Next we're going to turn back to the partner, make sure axis is straight, ribs rotate, hips rotate and feet rotate. Step forward walk, another strong turn to the right, Again, upper body, lower body foot, and backward walk, two. Replace, three towards your partner. We begin with a swivel, and four. Straight into delayed forward walk, pressing action forward. At this point, partner will indicate us to rotate again. So we transfer weight quickly onto the heel of the front foot, and swivel again. Step away from your partner, forward walk. Make sure that you do transfer all the body weight forward so that you can have a very full swivel back and your hip is going to do a nice amplitude and press. Again, same action, repeat. Transfer weight and swivel. Step away from the partner, swivel, press. Transfer weight and swivel away from the partner. Last one, we transfer weight fully, small swivel depending on where your partner is leading you. Then we're going into fan, so it's a forward walk, another forward walk, swivel all the way to fan position, backward walk, fan. And we're moving towards each other but still side by side. Four, one. Now I'm waiting for my leader to turn me so I can step back, two, and he's checking forward, transferring weight again. Now this is where it, it begins, circular hip twist. I'm going to now swivel my left foot because my wrist is turning me strongly towards him and stopping. Okay, so I'm breaking, pressing onto the right ball of the foot. At the same time, my wrist is doing is letting cross, preparing to move all the way back, making space for me to transfer weight and rotate away from him. 
Make sure you, that your arms are nice and round, make it so you have space to dance in. Notice that leader's arm is quite stretched forward to allow for that space. He's going to continue leading me away from him, however he's moving in a completely opposite direction. Now ladies, I sometimes keep my arm underneath this connection, sometimes above. It's really up to you depending on how much space you have. So I'll keep it above at this point. Now, Maris is going to step to the right, but this is here is a very important point because he's stepping to the right, but he is leading me away from him, almost to the opposite direction. So please note that it's very important to allow ladies to complete the forward walk transfer to the left foot away from the partner, strong pull back to him into the push. Immediate push. Continue roll the back body weight forward, transfer, step away, leave the partner to you again, and away, back to the leaders, and away, back to the leaders, and away to the leaders. And now the same to music. And two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One. Standing nice and tall over the right ball of the foot in fan position, prepare to rotate your right side to step through with the left foot, forward check, replace, close your feet, change weight, rotate the hip back, replace, close, change weight, cucaracha to the left, two, three, replace, close and change weight, and back replace, two, three, four, one. And two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Let's break down the steps here. Rotate your hip, bring your foot in. Close and change weight, brush your legs together, forward walk, ball flat, another forward walk, ball flat, upper body rotates into underarm turn, just like earlier in the steps. Then we're going to continue into a spiral. So here, upper body rotation, lower body Make sure you get all the way onto the ball of the front foot. Now we're going to spiral. Very important here to keep that axis straight. So upper body, lower body, and rotate in your foot. You see what happens with a free leg? It looks like it's spiraled around your standing leg. Next, we're going to continue with a rope spin. It's just forward walks curving around the partner. Hip rotation to activate on the standing leg. Flick the foot. Two and three and four. One little swivel. Two and three and four. One. And now the same to music. Four, one, two, three, four, 
One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. Now little steps to count and four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. Standing nice and tall over the ball of left foot, collect your right foot in to step forward, rotate, check and replace. Bring your left leg back and across into the Latin cross, passing through into side cucaracha. And repeat again, forward and across, rotate hip, check and replace, cross, Transition to the side and again forward and across. Check to finish. Two, three, four, one, and two, three, four, one, and two, three, and four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Two, breaking down sliding doors for followers. We're going to step forward and across in diagonal to the partner. The common mistake would be to step towards the partner. This would make you end up very far for the next step. So please make sure that you are stepping forward and across and your partner is kind of on the side of you. So you step Forward and across, your partner is moving through here. So this is your sliding effect. A quick swivel here. And you see I'm now stepping back, but I'm also going to swivel to make sure that I am now stepping exactly back away from my partner when he's going to be stepping forward there in the check by my side. Back three place and hip swivel delayed forward walk here you can transfer your weight forward slowly or just skip into the next side cucaracha if i do it slowly so that's two three four the slow version would be slow transfer and one swivel and cucaracha to the side after that, we're going to have to turn back to our partners. Upper body rotates, swivel. One more time, make sure we're going into the diagonal. So we step diagonally forward, allowing our partner to move across on our side. Swivel, continue a bit more turn, step back, replace, repeat. This time a quick version on the ball of the foot. And two, three, and four, one, here we connect back with our partner on the right hand side and back, replace. And now the same to music. Thank you very much for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. Please leave your questions or suggestions in the comments below and we will see you in the next video.